please stand for the pledge. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Carlsbad. We have a great show planned for you today. We'll have Luke live on DeGer to talk about a concert happening in Carlsbad. Charlie, what else is happening? That's right. We also have Robbie uh, live in the studio and Sebastian live on the magic window. Sounds like a great show, so let's get it started. I'm Isabel Linners. I'm Charlie Marinelli. And CHS TV starts right now. Welcome back. Next up, we have a story about a cowgirl who's in California. Let's, Robbie, rolls, get, Robbie gives us his piece. Howdy, friends. <laughs> a little about my life in, uh, in the olden days. And I have had the greatest of everything, more fun, this is Pat Omart, a legend in the Western world and an inspiration for girls across the country. We started out with horses. I was three years old riding bareback behind my sister. Although it may seem simple, Pat's first experience on a horse at a mere three years old forever changed the course of her life. And I loved to ride races, and my dad built a, a little small racetrack all around there to gallop. I had an old racehorse. What started out as a hobby for Pat quickly progressed into more professional fields, such as trick riding and jumping. Oh, well, these were the New York cowgirls, and uh, we were by the chutes. They just were getting some more publicity pictures. After traveling the world riding horses and even appearing in Hollywood films, Pat finally received some recognition for all of her hard work. But I hope to keep riding. I was inducted into the Cowgirl Hall of Fame 2012. I had been nominated 18 years previous. <laughs> At the young age of 93, Pat continues to do what she loves and has no plans on stopping. Reporting for CHSTV with Nate Nicholson, he, he was just the best horse that anybody ever had. I'm Robbie Rains. Thank you for that story, Robbie. If you're looking for leadership skills, the Carlsbad Ed Foundation is now accepting applications from all interested in the Carlsbad area for grades 9 through 12 next year. Apply at the link shown in the graphics. Peer tutoring is now available in the CHS library. All subjects are covered, and tutoring is available Monday and Fridays from 7.25 to 8.25 a.m as well as Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday from 3.30 to 4.30. No appointment is necessary. For our first live of the show, we will have Brooke live in the studio with ASB. Brooke? Good morning, Carlsbad. I'm here live with Emma and Romy from ASB to talk about Spirit Week. So what is today's Spirit, Way, Spirit Day and tomorrow's Spirit Day? Today is PJ Day and tomorrow's Padres Day. Sounds awesome. And what is Spear Week leading up to? This Spear Week is leading up to prom, which is this Saturday, May 6th, at the Park Nightclub. Sounds good. And could you give me some more details about prom? Yeah, so we're still selling tickets in the finance office for juniors and seniors. Um, with an ASB sticker, it's $90. And then without, it's $100. Sounds good. And anything else? Yeah, so parking-wise, uh, parking is going to be a little bit tricky uh, at this venue just because there is a Padres game happening uh, on Saturday around the time of prom. Um, so we have some suggestions, maybe some party bus, carpooling, Uber, um, just to kind of limit the amount of cars that are heading towards the venue uh, just so that you guys can find parking and everyone can have a blast. Sounds great. Any shout-outs, guys? Uh, Rowan Boyd behind the camera. Shout-out to Mr. Rosen and Mrs. Curtis, of course. Thank you guys so much for coming on, and Lancers, make sure to get your tickets for prom.
Thank you, Brooke. The 2023 free heart screening is for ages 12 to 25. The screenings include a cardiac risk assessment, EKG, a cardiologist consultation, and if indicated, a limited echocardiogram. The screening takes less than an hour and is completely painless. Visit epsavealife.org to register. The City of Carlsbad is in partnership with the Youth School, are offering high school students who reside in Carlsbad Students Leadership Academy this spring. Over 300 students have participated in the actor Interactive Academy throughout the years. Go to carlsbadstudentleaderacademy.com to register. The program is free and is a great addition to college application, applications and your resume. For a quick break in the announcements, we have theater live in the studio with Robbie. What's up, Robbie? Good morning, Carlsbad. I'm Robbie Rains. I'm here with Charlie and TJ from Theater. So Charlie's starting it off. I heard you guys have a show coming up. Do you want to talk about that? Yeah, so we have a show called spam -a -Lot coming up. It's a parody of a parody. It's Monty Python, and it's based on King Arthur and the Knights of the Round Table, and it is today, tomorrow, and May 11th, 12th, and 13th. That sounds great. I'll make sure to check it out. And TJ, what's going to be interesting about this show? Well, the interesting things we have, we've got people on stilts, big dance numbers, and a live orchestra. That sounds super exciting. And now, Charlie, I see this bunny here. Do you want to tell me about that? Yeah, so we're actually hiding bunnies around the school, um, and you can find them and earn a prize. So come to room 5002 to see what you got. That sounds great, Carlos. I'd make sure to look out for these bunnies. And any shout-outs? Kiana Nagrick. Tyler Marshall. All right, thanks, Carlos. Bad. I'll send it back to Charlie. Thanks, Robbie. 2023 graduation lays and kukui beads are now available for pre-order from LancerDancers.com. High school lays will need to be picked up at the CHS football field, ticket booth area, between 10 and 12 p.m., the morning of graduation on June 9th. Have you ever thought about a career in healthcare? Come hear from an expert in the field, nursing and allied health professor, as he shared his, shares his journey and gives advice to those interested in becoming healthcare professionals. This CHS Future Friday career chat is happening tomorrow during lunch. Free pizza for those who register. Details and a link to registration can be found in your grade level and Google Classroom. Up next, we have Landon live in the studio with Daybreak Club. Landon, what's happening? What's up, Carlsbad? I'm Landon Miller, and I'm here with Annika, Adam, and Alyssa from Daybreak Club. So first off, Annika, can you tell us where you guys meet and um, all that stuff for Daybreak? Uh, yeah, we're meeting in, we usually meet in the choir rooms, but today we're meeting in uh, the 7,000 <laughs> Uh, at today at lunch. Awesome. Wait, yeah, and then Adam, can you tell us what Daybreak is for the people who don't know? Yeah, you know, it's just a fun place where you can go and hang out, meet a bunch of new people. Uh, you can have pizza, hang out with friends, learn a little bit about God. Super fun place to go hang out. Awesome. And then is there anything going on that's interesting, like any events for Daybreak in the future? Yeah, so we have church this Sunday at 6 p.m., and we also have Camp Future this summer, June 26th through 29th. And if you're interested in registering, check out Daybreak Youth at Instagram, link in the bio. Awesome. And then, Annika, can you tell us the details for the future camp? Uh, yeah, so at Camp Future, it's three days long, and we have three services a day and do a lot of fun just activities, and you get to meet a lot of people from other churches, and we also go to a water park, so it's super fun. Show up. Awesome, make sure to go to uh, Camp Future. And now we're gonna do some shout outs. So Annika, you got any shout outs? Uh, Andrew Costanzo. <laughs> uh, shout out Connor Jensen. Uh, shout out Sophia Farr. <laughs> awesome, make sure to go to Camp Future and go to church this Sunday. Thanks Landon. During the first two weeks of May, there will be AP testing in the library. The library will be closed May 4th, 5th, 8th, 10th, 11th, and 12th. Please check the library door and announcement screen for specific hours and times of library closure. Peer tutoring will also be canceled these days. Want to surprise your parents with a heartwarming gift for Mother's or Father's Day? Look for CHS marketing flyers around campus with a QR code to purchase custom Mother's Day and Father's Day mugs for only $7. The sale ends on May 10th. Come by room 7104 for questions. Teachers, if you'd like to submit an announcement, go to chstv.com slash announcement. For our next break, we will have Luke live via satellite on DeGero to talk about the TJIF Friday concert in Carlsbad. Luke, what's going on? I'm here at the Calavera Park where uh, the city of Carlsbad will be throwing uh, the TJIF concerts this summer. Uh, the city just won a fourth place award uh, for the best outdoor concert venue in America. Uh, that was by USA Today. This is also the city's, uh, one of the city's longest running events and will be free of charge this summer. Uh, 
the concert will start July 7th and it'll run every single Friday up until August 11th at 6 p.m. That's all I have today, Carlsbad, and I'll send it back to Bella. That sounds great, Luke. Are you going to be coming? I'm going to be there. Perfect. Thank you for the update, Luke. Now we have Sebastian live on the magic window to give us some basketball news. What do you have for us, Sebastian? Yes, thank you, Charlie, and good morning, Carlsbad. My name is Sebastian Synthopoulos, and I'm here on our magic window today to give you guys a little bit of the playoff picture going on in the NBA right now. So as of April 11th, this was our playoff picture, but now moving into the quarterfinals, we only have eight teams left, and those start off with these, the Denver Nuggets, who are currently leading the Phoenix Suns to nothing right now. We're the first seed in the West, led by center Nikola Jokic. And then we also have the Phoenix Suns, who recently picked up Kevin Durant, and are also led by Devin Booker and Chris Paul. This has been a great series, and uh, Denver is on top currently. Moving on in the West, uh, we have the Los Angeles Lakers taking on the Golden State Warriors. The Warriors obviously led by Steph Curry. And then we have the Lakers led by uh, LeBron James. This has been a great series, and uh, Game 2 is coming up very soon. Moving on to the East, we have the Miami Heat led by Jimmy Butler and Bam Adebayo and the New York Knicks led by Jalen Brunson and Julius Randle. This has uh, also been a great series, and for the Knicks, it's been their first playoff appearance in a couple years. And one of the biggest matchups in the East has been uh, the Boston Celtics going on against the Philly Philadelphia 76ers, who are led by the current uh, NBA MVP, Joel Embiid. And the Celtics are led by power forward Jason Tatum and uh, shooting guard uh, Jalen Brown. So this has been a great series so far. It's 1-1. Boston just picked up a big statement win uh, on or last night, it was actually. So that was a great win for the Celtics, and it's also been a great series. So looking forward to seeing this one go. And uh, yeah, Bella, it's been a great series. So. Like great mashups. Who are you rooting for? So I, I do have the Celtics winning this. I think they're going to be taking on uh, the Lakers in the championship, but I have the, uh, the Celtics coming out on top. Personally, I'm rooting for the Lakers, but we'll see what happens. Thanks, Sebastian. Now let's take an exciting behind-the-scenes look at an upcoming band here in Carlsbad. Hi, my name's Anton. Oh, Max? I'm, the, I'm Jetty. <laughs> I'm Max. I'm Dom. And, and we're we Don and Jive. <laughs> Looks like a great story. Sadly, that's the end of our show today, but may the fourth be with you, Carlos Bad. Bye. Bye.